Only two days left until a deadline set by the Trump administration for DACA legislation. Marchers took to the streets in Vancouver today, rallying to protect DACA recipients. Queen 6's Jennifer Dowling joins us live from Vancouver with that. Jennifer. Good afternoon. There were around 50 people that marched here to Esther Short Park in Vancouver this afternoon. They started a few blocks away on Anderson Street, right outside the office of U.S. Representative Jamie Herrera Butler. Now they're calling on all members of Congress from both parties to support a clean Dream Act for undocumented youth. After their march to the park, activists called for an end to deportations and cynical politics as well. We need to work on immigration. I'm not a great expert, but I think there's a better way to do it than what we're doing now. And no one should live in fear. We made a promise to the dreamers that we would protect them, not send them back to a country they weren't familiar with. And the Republican Congress and president have backed up, have backed out of that promise. The League of United Latin Citizens in Southwest Washington helped to organize this march. The group estimates there are nearly 2 million young undocumented immigrants who have lived in the U.S. most of their lives and have in some cases left behind societies torn by persecution and violence. The group says polls also show that as many as 75 percent of Americans support some type of DREAM Act. Back to you. Jennifer, thank you. We can tell you 